Oh, wait. Hello? Hello? What? So, your camera, it triggered some loud explosion noises. Uh, yep. <coughs> Actually, the victim in this case we are researching, he was shot with a pistol. A uh, pistol? Right. Wouldn't a gunshot make a similar <coughs> noise to our party popper? I guess it would. Your camera, didn't it get a picture oh. of murder? Hey, y'all are pretty bright. Eh? I see what you're saying. Tell you what, I'll have a look see at my film. It would have been a photo taken last night. I checked them once. Don't remember if there was anything on them, though. But what if I get got something? I could be a witness to a genuine murder. Yeehaw! I'll go check that film. Y'all come back now, you hear? She seems way too excited about this. <laughs> she went inside her SUV. I guess we should come back later? Yes. <coughs> Anything here yet? No. Okay. Yes, Detective Gumshoe is still in that meeting. <sighs> hey! Thanks for coming down, pal! Detective Gumshoe! We just finished the meeting. For better or wor for worse. <coughs> I'm definitely feeling we're in for some bad news. You know anything about the victim yet? No, no. Still can't ID him. Has Mr. Edgeworth said anything? Not a word. Why is it? Yeah. I can't get his voice back. He lost his voice? Yes. Yeah, he's still talking. Interesting. <laughs> So, how did the meeting go? I can't tell you, pal. You're a lawyer. Trail? You know... I don't know what to believe anymore. Sure, Mr. Edgeworth is human like you or me. Still... I get the feeling that if he'd done something wrong, he wouldn't go hiding it. That's just the guy, kind of guy he is. Why can't anyone else see that? So they think Mr. Edgeworth did it? Well, the truth's starting tomorrow as scheduled. The trial. The trial is starting tomorrow as scheduled. <laughs> It's okay! <laughs> I see. Um, you... Hey, in the end, you did tell us something about the meeting. Don't go telling anyone else, pal. Y yes sir. And, do me a favor. Uh Stand by, Miss Mr. Edgeworth. He needs help, and you're the ones to help him. I'm sure he's got some reason why he won't talk to us. Thanks, Detective Gumshoe. <coughs> Detective
Detective Gumshoe. How can you trust Mr. Edgeworth so much? Well, uh, I think that was obvious. Uh, I've got a strong wor working relationship. We we have a strong working relationship, us <laughs> two. We trust each other. That's how it works. Why does he sound like a, a lamb or a sheep when he said that? <laughs> Edgeworth is not a bad guy, I swear. <laughs> a working relationship? See, Mr. Edgeworth always gets his defendants declared guilty every time. Yeah, his methods might be a little too much. Wait, let me pause it. No. Hi. Uh, pretty much all you missed was uh, we got. I don't. We got a photo and we found out this person witnessed the murder. Yeah. Well, we got the autopsy report. Maya recognized oh, yeah, the person in the picture. And this guy, this guy, this first, <laughs> she has pictures of the murder and she's a witness. And she ha- oh, well. That picture that Dougie thought was a picture in the beginning really was a picture, but at that point it wasn't a picture, it was actually, I don't know. No, I thought it was a painting. I thought they were like in a museum or something. Yes. And Looking at a painting. Oh. And it apparently- uh, Lotta forgot that she witnessed the murder. Y'all reckon I should tell the cops? The options are beautiful. <laughs> what did you hear? Uh, sure. I mean, if you really do think, then yeah. Uh, reckon so. What's that? Now don't y'all... Go trying to mock up my accent. I'm a sensitive lady. Hey, so I'm trying to talk to the cops. Why did she sound like her accent changed for a second there? <laughs> <laughs> hey, so I'm going up and trying to talk to the cops. <laughs> Y'all can have this photo. Later. What? Can't y'all see? I'm kind of busy? <coughs> Tell us what you saw, too, please. Nice try, honey, but I was born yesterday. I'm a witness, and that means I'm on the side of justice. And that means... The cop. Oh, she's on the side of the cops. I'm, I was like, what does she mean? She, what? What? I'd sooner eat the south side of a northbound skunk than tell you. Lala! Don't let it get to your skeevies in a bunch. Your skeevies in a bunch? Friends today, enemies tomorrow. Or was it the other way around? No matter, I'm gone. Hey, maybe let me do some testifying. Hot darn. Oh my goodness. She left. Oh, her voice was fun to do. She might, she might come back later, hopefully. Well, she will come back later. Well, oh, yay! That, that's one more witness. What do we do now, Nick? Well, if she saw something, there's not much we can do about it. Maya sounded slightly southern in that last line. Slightly, but... Well, which is natural. You tend to pick yes. up accents when you're talking to someone with an accent. So that works. True. Maya, from this point on, will be Southern. No! <laughs> no, I'm Please, kidding. No. no, Maya's voice will not change. Thank goodness. Of 
question is, what exactly did she say? Yes, Phoenix, that is the question. I guess we'll find out tomorrow. In trial tomorrow. <laughs> Okay. Okay. It's actually recording this time. <laughs> Looks like the police have given up their questioning. Hey! Ah! Uh, Nick, I think Santa's mad at you. Long time no see, Nick. Nick. You know Santa? Wow, Nick and Saint Nick. Hey, I see the connection. Don't be ridiculous. Dude, it's me. Larry? What are you doing here? Isn't it obvious? I'm working my day job. I sell samurai dogs. Want one? Gotta get money for dates. You know, my girl, Keyonce, deserves the best. Keyonce? Not another model, I hope. Oh, Keyonce is a fine, fine woman, Nick. It was her idea that I wear this costume. She was all, you go, girlfriend, you know? She brought this, she bought this costume for me. That, that's great, Larry. Wow, a Santa costume. She must be really nice. Whoa. Hmm. Nick. Who is she? She's not yours. Uh, she is... Seventeen. Uh, Larry. A.K.A. Minor Larry. <laughs> I'm his partner, Maya Faye. I'm, uh, the little sister. Sister? Well, Nick must be tough. Working nine to five, having to take care of a little sister? N no, I'm not Nick's sister. I'm my older sister's little sister. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> yes, Maya! That's how that typically works! <laughs> <laughs> huh, sounds great! <coughs> Don't worry, Maya, he's not listening. But clearly he was listening before, because he said... Nick, you're wasting your time. Last night was Christmas Eve. He was with Keyonce, obviously. He wouldn't be have been standing out here in the cold. Oof. I think what you just said caught him off guard, Maya. No, it's it just... Ke Ke Keyonce is not in town right now. She's... She she's in Hawaii. Uh, on a photo shoot. <coughs> I knew it. I mean, the fact though that he's getting all of these models is, uh... Well, anyway, there was a murder here in the, um, the late... Some, the, the trial is tomorrow. Huh? Neat. Why does everyone say that? The defendant is Edgeworth. Miles Edgeworth. Um, Nick, why would Larry know Edgeworth? Whoa, Nick! You don't mean that that Miles Edgeworth, old Edgy? Yeah, he's a murder suspect. Whoa, m murder? Huh? 
Huh? Y you know Mr. Edgeworth, Larry? Y yeah, of course. And she was in the same class as us in grade school. Well, wow, finally, someone's giving my answers. What? <coughs> um, um, t tell me about the dogs. Huh? Uh, oh, you, you mean the samurai dogs? Why are they samurai dogs? I I mean, they kind of look gourd-shaped. Oh, uh, well, originally they were gourd dogs. You know, like, gourd dogs? Ouch. The, the samurai thing was Keonse's idea. Oh, she, she's my woman, you know? She was all, change the name and you go, girlfriend. She made me that banner. Man, the kids can't get enough of those samurai dogs. Um, so something about that just seems wrong. Oh, and guess what? We're we're getting a ton of customers here at the lake. W what with the big news? The big news. Yeah, Gordy. G Gordy. Back to Edgeworth. So, Mr. Edgeworth was your classmate, Larry? Yeah, Nick, him, and I used to hang out all the time. Wow, I never knew. Don't get me wrong, he's always been kind of a stick in the mud. Studying all the time, trying to be like, be like father. Like his father? Yeah, Edgy's Pop was the most famous defense lawyer back in the day. Well, wait, you said defense lawyer? Yeah. W wait a second, but uh, Miss Redworth is a prosecuting attorney. W what? Edgy's got a props. <laughs> <laughs> a proboscis on his knee? No, he's a prosecuting attorney. That's like the total opposite of a defense lawyer. Huh? Yo figure. He always used to talk about defending the weak who are unable to defend themselves. Man, he used to go on and on about man's duty to society and all that. What a bore. I wonder what changed his mind, though. Do you know Nick? Nick? Um, what's Gordy? <laughs> I like how they just keep going back and forth between these two. Yeah. <laughs> huh, you mean you don't know? It's here in this very lake. A giant mysterious monster. Gordy. Uh, the monster? Yeah. Check it out. This is an article from yesterday's newspaper. Here's a photo. Wow, it's really real. Nick, a monster, a real monster. We got into the fr- oh wait. And we, when we got into the frame, we heard a loud bang, like an explosion, followed by the sound of something slipping into the water. You, you probably could have read that. I don't think it was Lada. It, it was the people in the picture. <laughs> the person who started off Kind of southernish, and then immediately lost that <laughs> accent. 
I mean, it could have been another southern person, but nope, she just lost that accent right away. Right after she realized that she wasn't Lada, she was having an identity crisis. I wish I could have seen it. Why would there be a sound like an explosion? Mary? Uh, we're going to leave it off here. Thanks for watching, Pharaoh. Yeah.